Hey, just so you know, we bought you some lunch meat so you can tell the school they can stop calling. I talked to Troy. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he invited me to a party. Hey, great. Did you find out what position he's playing? Actual son here trying to work through a problem. Anyway, at first I was looking forward to going, but now I'm worried. What am I going to say to a bunch of jocks? Can you give me some football terms to use so I don't embarrass myself trying to fit into the conversational bouquet? Well, first of all, I'd steer clear of bouquet. Second, just talk about anything. Just be yourself. Should I talk about Charlie Rose? No. Why would you do that? Well, I like his interviewing style. The way he takes one topic and really delves into it. I don't know. Just talk. Like, uh, hey, what class are you in? Where'd you get those sneakers? You're giving me tall guy advice. That all works coming from you. If I did it, I'm just a weirdo paying too much attention to people's shoes. Okay, whatever. I'm just saying don't put so much pressure on it. Relax. You know a joke? Tell a joke. I don't know any jokes. Oh. Well, um... Okay, here's one I like. Your mom is so ugly, when she goes to the zoo, she needs two tickets. One to get in, and one to get out. I don't understand. Well, they're saying that she's so ugly, they think she's an animal. So she needs a, a ticket to get out of the zoo. So you're saying if an animal had a ticket, the zoo would just let it out? That's not safe. And how would it even carry a ticket with its hooves? No, well, you're missing the point. Is the animal being let out of the zoo the joke part? No, the woman is so ugly, they think she's an animal. That's the joke. Is it? Yes! So I'm insulting someone's mother, animals are on the loose causing chaos in society, and the zoo is somehow charging people to leave. I'm sorry, there's just so much wrong with this, Dad. Thank you, but when it comes to talking to teenage football players, I'll take my chances with Charlie Rose.